pre-op uh, prep to actually done that for them at home and therefore they would come in the day of surgery. We don't have a lot of immediate processing on the day, it's all been done beforehand. Patients like to sleep in their own bed the night before surgery, so they come in uh, on the day of surgery. Uh, everything is well thought through in terms of the uh, structure for patient care on the day of surgery and post-op. Everybody's very familiar now because of the numbers that are going through the one day unit here. Uh, it's very easy for them to look after the patients uh, and for them to have confidence in them going home the next day. Yeah, I think there's been a much faster recovery, not just in the immediate 24 hours or so after surgery, because for example, a patient having surgery today, we'd expect them to have a normal supper tonight, a normal breakfast tomorrow and go home. And that would be you know, unusual in the, in the days of open surgery, I think. But, but still, when they go home the next day after surgery, expect them to be fully ambulant, to be mobilised and to be quite active. It's been fantastic. I mean, um, considering it's such a major surgery, uh, I'm surprised how, how lightly I've got off with some of the things. But there, there was nothing that I couldn't deal with. Um, the, the, there's no need for painkillers, for instance. Went straight home, got back into normal routine, eating, drinking. Um, and it, it's, it's been a lot easier than I thought it would be. Uh, considering it is a major surgery. I volunteered to do the buddy system because again I found that uh, I started to get people uh, after I let it be known that I'd got the cancer. Uh, everybody knew two or three people that uh, would pass on information to me which again was was really good in making my decisions and I think it, it's the only thing I can do for the people following. I mean the, the greatest buddy system was being on the ward. As I walked in there were other people there that had had it done the day before and as I was waiting to go in, they were telling me, don't worry, and I could see it, it, was, it was nothing to worry about.